Schwenke and welcome back to my channel. I want to thank Jane and Clay Company for sponsoring today's video. Today I'm going to be reviewing their ultimate backpack in the Desert Sands color with the black hardware. And as you saw in the first part of this video where I showed this bag on the body, it's a medium sized backpack. So this backpack is 15 inches tall, so it can fit a 13 inch laptop. It's 11 inches wide and it's 6 inches deep. And I find this size perfect for quick trips out and packed as a diaper bag or for yourself on trips. And today I have it packed up for me and my three-year-old. And first I wanna talk about this awesome material that they used on this bag. This is marine grade premium ostrich texture vegan leather in the color Desert Sands. And it feels very high quality and it looks super upscale and classy. I just love it, you guys. I'm gonna show you guys an up close look at that real quick. It's also water resistant and it has the matte black hardware, which looks amazing with this print. And they also offer a lot of different color options, hardware and alternate textures as well. So before I jump into the packing portion of this video, I do wanna go over the outside features of this bag. So as I mentioned, you have this beautiful matte black hardware. The front plate here has the Jane and Clay Co. logo, which I think is really pretty. The front is very sleek looking and it features only one pocket that zips across the front of the bag here. This pocket is shallow and flat, but it's perfect for things like a small wallet, your keys, your phone, and things like that. So let's move on to the sides of the bag. There is nothing going on here, you guys. There's no bottle pockets or anything. All that stuff can fit inside of your bag. So I love that though, because it keeps it very streamlined looking. Onto the back of the bag, because this is where I feel like there's a lot of stuff going on. And I can't wait to show you guys because it has a lot to offer with this bag. So here are your backpack straps. They are so squishy and comfortable, you guys. I love wearing this bag because it is really comfortable to wear. On the top here, you have a webbed grab handle, which feels really durable. It's easy to grab and go out of the car. The backpack straps here feature two buckles on the top here. As you can see, like this, you can hook this onto a stroller or onto a shopping cart and be hands-free. The backpack straps itself on the underside has the ostrich vegan leather, and it is really comfortable. On the opposite side, you have a seatbelt strap type of material with the Jane and Clay Co. logo on it, which I think is super cool looking. I really love that they use such a large font. It just feels very designer stylish, so I really like that. These are also really adjustable straps. They go pretty long, so if you are small like me, I'm five foot two, this will fit you. If you're even smaller than me, it will fit you, because. I do have some slack here. So if you have a child that wants to wear this size bag, this is perfect for them too. If you are bigger than me, like six foot tall, you could get away with this as well because there's a lot of slack. These are really comfortable padded straps though. I really like them. On the underneath part here, you have the Jane and Clay Co. logo across the back here with the seatbelt strap material as well. You also have a little zippered pocket back here, which just fills this back part right here. And then this goes all the way down so you could put this onto the back of your suitcase if you guys are traveling, going through the airport, it just leaves you a little bit more hands-free. So I really love that, and this bag is just so perfect for that type of thing, for travel and stuff like that. Another thing that's on the bottom of the bag here, I'll, sh I'll just like flip it around for you guys. You have these two straps here that are adjustable. You can make this pretty long if you want. So if you have a large beach towel or a yoga mat or something like that, you can just loop it through here and clip it and unclip it for easy access. So it's just really, really handy. I love that. There's so many cool tricks with this bag. <laughs> so let's go ahead and jump onto the packing portion of this video. I can't wait to share how I pack it up. So let's get started. So let's start with the back of the bag because I do actually have something in this back pocket here and it is my wallet. As a lot of you know, I like to use the Jujube B Charged because it's very slim and flat and does not take up a lot of space. So I have my Jujube B Charged here in the black magic print, and that just fits really great back here, especially for travel if you don't want somebody getting into your bag and stealing your things. Um, it's always good to keep your wallet on your back so that nobody can get to it. So this fits really perfect down in there, but this is a great place to keep tickets, receipts, and other flat types of things that won't bother your back. So that's all that I have in there. Moving back to the front of the bag. This is a really cool pocket. It is, like I said, flat and long. So this is a great pocket for your phone, your keys, and things like that. And I actually have my iPhone 11 Max Pro down in here. 
which I was very happy to see fit just fine. That's all that I had in this pocket, but I did want to show you guys that's what it looks like. The lining on this bag is black, so I suggest when you pack it up to use bright colored pieces or something that's easy to see. So I will show you guys now that I've gone over the outside of the bag how I have the inside packed up. So one of the things I wanted to mention about this bag is how great the zippers are, you guys. They are so smooth. I love it so much. <laughs> it makes it a lot easier and more fun to open your bag. So let's go ahead and open it up. It only goes about, I wanna say, three quarters of the way down, which is great, so your stuff doesn't just fall out. This is what the inside looks like and how I have it packed up. As I mentioned, you'll want to use lighter colored pieces when you pack this bag because otherwise things can get lost. Um, I'm not a huge fan of black linings because of that reason, but I do love the organization on this bag. And when you use the right pieces, you'll be able to access your things way faster and easier. I'm gonna go ahead and flip this back so that you guys can see a little bit better. As you can see back here, I love the little details that they put into this bag, but they have the Jane and Clay Co. piping all along the inside here, which is really pretty. You have the Jane and Clay Co. logo right here. So let's go through the inside. There are a lot of fun pockets in here, so if you need a lot of organization in a small bag, this is a great option. So I guess we'll go through the middle first. So on this side here, I have a Jujube medium set piece. And in here I have snacks and things for my son. So I have a little go-go squeeze, a granola bar, and then I also have a half sandwich because we are going to be going out soon and he's gonna need that. <laughs> so that is his little snack bag. Next to that I have my Jujube large set piece here. I like to keep a change of clothes for him. So I have some shorts because it's still warm out. I also have a pair of socks a little shirt, and also a pair of underwear for him. Now that we have the middle portion taken care of, you guys can see a little bit better down in there. You have a lot of pockets. You have a large elastic slip pocket back here. You have two smaller bottle pocket type of slip pockets down here that are elastic as well. On the front here, you have two more on the front, they don't go all the way down the length of the bag like these front two do. They're about halfway, so you can put smaller things in there like my small set pieces here. And then you have another front large pocket as well. So let's go ahead and go through these. And then I'll try my best to show you guys what these pockets look like when they're empty. So on this side here, I have a small nine ounce water bottle filled with water for myself. On the other side here, I have a little apple and Eve juice box for my son. In the back pocket here, I have a white pouch 30 with wipes in it. Next to it, I have a Baby Olay wet bag. In the very back pocket here, because you do have another zipper pocket, this is where I keep my keys. And you would think that maybe that wouldn't be comfortable on my back, but this whole bag is padded with a nice soft but thick foam. So the back is really comfortable on your back. Even the bottom is padded that way and the front as well. So that does not bother my back but that is a great pocket for keys. We've gone through that back part there, so let's go through the front. Here's the front. I've got two small set pieces. I'll go through this one first. This is a small set piece in Black Magic. I have a few toys in here for my son. He's obsessed with Super Wings, so I have some of these little Transformer Super Wings characters. Just, just three, that's all we really need for quick trips out. So this type of thing holds toys great and it keeps things a little bit more contained. In this pocket here I have things for myself. This is another small set piece. I just have some lip gloss, chapstick, a mirror, folding hairbrush, and some lotion down in there. Alright, last pocket. I have a couple of face masks, one for my son Colton and one for me. And that's it. So hopefully you guys will be able to see real well now how this bag looks. I know it's a little difficult because it's black, but um, I'll try to fix the lighting a little bit so you guys can see better. But it's got a ton of space for the size of it. This is not a huge bag, you guys. It's very much like my favorite type of size to use for diaper bags. So it works really, really great for us and it's really comfortable. 
and I just love the way it packs. I really love this bag and I highly recommend it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and definitely subscribe while you're here if you're new. You can shop Jane and Clay Co. bags through the link in the description box. And through every sale, 10% of it goes to single families in need through the Jane and Clay Co.'s Giving Back Tour. Thanks for watching!